Welcome to the Academic Skills Resource on Finding Errors in Writing. This resource helps you identify and correct writing errors related to commas, quotation marks, and possessive apostrophes for punctuation, and for grammar, choosing the right word forms, pronouns, and verbs for each subject. Look at this paragraph. How could its punctuation and grammar be improved. This paragraph has six errors, one each regarding the possessive apostrophe, quotation marks, commas, word form, subject verb agreement, and pronouns. Three punctuation errors occur in the first three sentences. Can you find and correct any? Pause the slide if you need more time to find them. Firstly, to show possession, the possessive apostrophe is required. Here, however, it is not, as it relates to the campuses, so it should be possessive rather than it apostrophe s, a contraction for it is or it has. The second sentence, moreover, is not a direct quote, so quotation marks are unnecessary as it is an indirect quote, signalled by the word that. Finally, a verb should not be separated from its subject with a comma. So teach should link directly to what is being taught Year 3 to Year 6 classrooms in the Solomon Islands. Here is the corrected paragraph. Three grammar errors occur in the last sentence. Can you find and correct any? Pause again if you need to. The right form of a word must be used. For example, is a thing, noun, describing word, adjective, or action word, verb, required? The verb form here is incorrect. Rather, a passive verb form is required that agrees with the plural subject, they. Furthermore, as they is plural, the verb should match the subject. It should be are, not is, which is only for singular or uncountable nouns. Finally, in the bracket, them is used. However, it can only refer to an object, not a subject, and thus, given the resources previously mentioned, it should be these. Here is the corrected paragraph. Here is the complete paragraph with all errors corrected.